Welcome to another exciting episode of Jonna's Makeup Imagination. Today we'll be taking a look at her daily routine. Hey everybody again, it's Jonna. Since the last uh, video went long, then this one's going to be shorter. I thought I would tell you exactly what I do um, with my regular beauty routine. So, I've got my glasses on so I can read and see. Okay, to start with... Okay, I don't use any particular special body wash. Um, I mean, I'm using some Bath and Body Works, but I can use Caress or whatever. That didn't bother me or anything. So I was letting that know with a loofah. Main thing I wanted to talk to you about was um, my shampoo, which is Nexus New York Salon Style. And it's a Color Sure Color Vibrancy System Shampoo. Uh, silicone free, sulfate free, white orchid extract, concentrated protein. It says that um, enriched with white orchid extract and concentrated 100% pure elastine protein, color assure, rebalances shampoo free of sulfates, gently cleanses and nourishes hair, helping to protect color vibrancy. Okay. Thing about that is now though. Is that I really, my hair hardly, the only color I've got now is on the bottom. It's like ombre. That's how long it's been since I've colored my hair. So my hair's like, that's it, that's ombre. But at least the stand's not going anywhere. <laughs> so anyway, so that's what I used for my shampoo. And by the way, I got that on sale. If you care to get it, it is the Best you can get, I think, when it comes to keeping your hair color in. I've used a, I mean, I've been coloring my hair for many, many years, and I've recently discovered this. Um, in fact, Kristen Leanne, another YouTuber who, uh, she always has really rainbowy looking hair, and it's really pretty. Um, and she says to keep her color vibrant, she uses this color to keep it safe and, and, and to keep her um, semi-permanent hair color in longer. And then she uses some other kind of shampoo to actually make it come out. So, but that's what she uses to keep in. So it's a real good thing for um, to keep your color fresh and stay on. Secondly, I'm bringing it up again, but I have to tell you, I love it. My Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. No sulfates, no silicones, no parabens. I love this. It says it contains a unique blend of avocado, sweet almond, and argan oils, hair essential vitamins, B5, and biotin repair damaged hair, enhance shine, and reduce breakage by up to 81% after three uses. What you do with it, I think I've mentioned this before, and this is what I like about it. Can you go and see it? There we go. What I like about it is that. You can put it on your entire hair. I mean, most things only want you to put it on the bottom. They don't want it everywhere. And um, so it's really cool. I mean, you just open it up and, it's, you know, it's like cream, whatever. And you put it on top and you put it on bottom. And I just leave it on as I, you know, shower everywhere else and shave my legs and all that good fun stuff. Um, and when you rinse it, you don't rinse it completely out, which is another thing that's really cool. Because, you know, you go through life and... It seems like it's always difficult to uh, get your conditioner <laughs> completely <laughs> rinsed out. So uh, it's really cool that you don't have to do that with this one. You don't have to worry about it. Um, and it's also good, always a little trick to know. And of course, all the hair uh, salon ladies out there already know is that um, if you have a dash of cold water on your hair but right before you get out of the shower, um, well, a little bit more than a dash, but um, it'll seal up the cuticles and hold in that, all that uh, moisturizing and all the vitamins and oils and things and keep that in. Okay, that's my second thing. And I've talked about this before too, but I'm going to tell you anyway. Um, I don't use any um, lotions, really, other than this, other than this. Um... I have really soft skin. I don't know why. I think it came from my mother. I think I'm fortunate in that. Um, but 
when I use, and it's real easy to use because you're doing it when you're coming out of the shower. Another thing, too, is that lotions, if you're ever going to use any kind of lotions, it's best to do it right out of the shower because your pores are opened up and it's going to, you know, suck those things in. Um, but anyway, I'm, I've been using, I guess for about a year now, this Jergens, let's see, Jergens Wet Skin Moisturizer. And it's an, it's an Allure 2015 good one. Again, like I said the other day with the masks. Anyway, um, wet skin moisturizer locks in hydration. It skin's peak moisture moment for luminous skin. And this one's coconut. So um, it says get ready in half the time. And pretty much you get out of the shower and uh, you apply it when you're still wet. And then you don't you don't rinse it off or anything. So you just put you put like a quarter size for your legs area and a dime size for your arms and stuff. And you leave it on, you dry off, and then there, there you go. Okay. Another thing. Last thing about hair. I talked about this the other day, but I've got to bring it up again because I just love it. I mean, I, I don't know if y'all can see my hair at all. Well, I think it looks cool. My hair to start with, all of a sudden now, has I mean you see how long it is. But all of a sudden, recently, it started getting darker. How dark my hair is? It's crazy. And I think it's all because of these healthy things I'm using. But this Verb Ghost Oil. Do you see it? Yeah, it's made by these ladies in Austin, Texas. Some salon ladies. And it's called Smoothing Morninga. Morninga? M-O-R-I-N-G-A, excuse me for not knowing how to say it, blend of weightless hair oil. And you only use like a couple drops. And I got this, it's paraben free, no gluten, no sulfates. I can't even believe I can even read this, this is so small. But anyway, all you use is a couple drops of it. And uh, like I've told you time and time and time and time and time again about getting with Sephora because, I mean, you get on to new things that nobody else knows about. I mean, a lot of times I'll get, like the like the Briageo, I had samples of it when they didn't even have it in the store. They didn't have it online. And I was trying to buy it. It's like, we don't know what you're talking about. I mean, you get stuff, you know, from the right when it hits the ground, uh, new stuff. So anyway, this verb, go, ghost oil, is so cool. It just slicks your hair, and it's so light, you don't even feel it. It just, just... It's not flat, it's just shiny and pretty. Anyway, I love it. I put it on when my hair is, is uh, still uh, moist and not dry yet. And I also put it on, um, like today I put it on, because it's on film, to kind of keep the flyaways less flyaway. Okay. <laughs> now, um, along with that, I'm just going to say it real quick, because along with that, um... I know I've told you this before, but I swear to you, this is this is really the key to. Uh, I feel like my hair is my is my biotin, and I take one a day. I had to take the most that you can take. It's ten thousand micrograms dietary supplement for hair, skin, and nail health. Biotin is a B vitamin that is essential for healthy energy metabolism and also supports healthy hair, skin, and nails. And I'm telling you, it works. It really does. I was I was taking some that was like um oh, what do you call it um dissolve like they dissolve I mean they taste good or whatever they do, but they weren't working right so I mean I went back to the it's just a regular whoo, uh, gel pill so you know real soft and easy to swallow uh makes just uh, uh, i mean my nails were breaking and then now they're coming back again so uh, yes biotin please 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 i think this bottle was like eight bucks at walmart or maybe none but it's 120 in there like i said get the strongest you can it does say on here though not to use it if you are pregnant or nursing so anyway okay um next thing real quick <laughs> oh I want to bring out too. I don't know how many of you have one of these these wet brushes. Uh, so it's what they're called, it's wet brush. Um, this will pull out tangles like you don't know. You see how slick it goes through there. It's just I me mean, can hear it. But you can you you 
it's designed to brush your hair when it's wet so it gets all the tangles out wonderful period especially wonderful if you've got a little girl like I did at one time when she was little she would scream and holler and have so much trouble when I used a tangler and everything with her hair and she would scream and holler so much when she got her hair brushed that I threatened her constantly about cutting it and then she's like no 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 please 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 and so I didn't ever cut it and we went on this for years and then she gets to be about uh, 12 13 and decides she wants her hair to be shorter I mean it's not short short her dad won't let her he's against it it's about that long <laughs> I don't know that's his deal okay anyway so it's really good now next thing I do this like this I'm going in order of me coming out of the shower I don't know if you recognize that okay then the next thing I do is I, I've showed you this before the caudalie uh, uh, wrist the lift the eye lifting balm I what what I like about this is that you you put it on the top of your eyelids. I know I mention it probably every single time I do a video about how one, I don't know which one it is right now looking at it, but um because I'm not looking at it. But one of my eyelids is trying to droop already, which no telling where it's going to be. It's going to be like down here, not too long. But anyway, and see so what you do with this. You take a, a little pea size amount, put it on your little ring fingers because those are the lightest ones. And then you put it underneath your eye and around here too, which is like your crow's feet area. And you can put it on under your brow area. So that helps it lift it and get it to where it does not um, droop <laughs> as easily. At least I hope not. Now this, I want to show y'all too. We're talking about uh, Sephora again. Okay. Do you see this? I bought this. I don't know what I paid. This is the eye cream. Okay. I don't know what I paid for this right now, but. I, I paid some money for it. And this, okay, do you see it? They're about almost, I think, they're, are they the same size? This one says 0.5 fluid ounces. Yes, they're the same size, okay, you see? And I paid full price. I mean, I got a, here, I'll show you my. Yeah, I'm about to lose everything. It's like, please light, do not go off. Wait just a second. Let's see if I can get it out of my drawer. <laughs> okay, originally, <laughs> This was a sample I got of the the eye cream. Okay, so that's the sample I got. And so I loved it so much. I still have a little bit left, so I keep it in here. Love it so much. I bought one. So this is a regular size. This one. Okay. Can't remember. Anyway, that's the regular size, and that's the sample size. Okay. My point about this is, and I keep talking to you about Sephora, 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 Sephora. I got, this is the Fluid Lift, this Face Lifting Moisturizer Broad Spectrum SPF 20, uh, the, uh, the Caudalie Moisturizer. This is everyday moisturizer, exactly the same size of the, of the eye lift cream that I bought. So this was, this came in my box free, this size, right there. Not only did that one come like that, here I am, I'm digging, I'm going to, my light's going to go off. Okay, this one did, is this a little one? Now this is not as big right here, but I love this one. If, I, if I'm going to buy another one, I'm going to buy this one. This is the Cream Sorbet Moisturizer. Oh, it's so light. But anyway, that too. I'm showing you all my clothes. <laughs> but anyway, I mean, there's all kind of, uh, like, they when they started coming out with the um, We Hair brand. I mean, look at this. Look at this bottle. Look how much that is. 0.7 ounces. I mean, this is what you're getting. I got so much stuff, I don't hardly have to buy it. But anyway, that's the mo that's Everyday Moisturizer Eye Lifting Cream. I don't use the everyday moisturizer. I mean, I use it in the morning when I put makeup on and stuff. But when I get out of the sh a bath at night, I put my cream, my eye lifting cream on, and this is the last thing, I promise. And I've talked about this before, but I can't sing its praises enough because I love it. And it's the Coors Wild Rose, um, what is it? Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial. And all you do, oh, it smells, it smells just like, can you see it? I mean, it's a very a big bottle. Let's say it's got 1.35 fluid ounces. I suppose just like anyway, and I put that on my face at night, and it just 
there's something about the rose smell and the way, I mean, it just, I wake up and it, it's just helping me. This is, see, I haven't been doing this, uh, what do you call it, um, the makeup and, and, well, I've been doing makeup for a long time, but I've never done the moisturizing, like putting moisturizer, you know, anything but like olive oil a or something. And, of course, I'm getting to a time in my life when I need to think about moisturizing, which is funny. It's like a Miranda Lambert's song where she says where you, you, uh, you, you start self tanning and, and then spend, and you spend less time tanning and more time moisturizing. So, uh, I'm at that point. So anyway, I just wanted to show that to you real quick, a little quick video, which is never quick anyway. And if any of these products you think might help you and you think you might like, I mean, go for it. They've done good for me. They're just, <laughs> look at Yoshi. He's like, Okay, you're looking at me. What does that mean? He really said bye a minute ago. You gonna wiggle your tail? Where's that tail? Where's the tail? Where's that tail? You ain't gonna wiggle it? What's you doing? What's you doing? What's you doing? There's that tail. What's you doing? You big good boy? Are you a good boy? Yes, you are. Alright. Anyway, remember once again, like, share, subscribe, and I will be back with another one soon. And bye from Yoshi. Say bye, Yoshi. <laughs> and as always, bye from me. Thanks. Everyone like, share, and please subscribe. The only reason why he's doing this is he's tired of me whining about not getting enough likes.